I met Kevin Hart and Tiffany Haddish. You got to meet Kevin Hart? Yes. Oh, my <laughs> kids would die. They love Kevin Hart. Hi, and welcome to Kelly, where we talk about life, your life and my life. And through Kelly, we hope to inspire. I have Isabella Ribeiro on the show today. Did I say that right? Yes. Okay, good for me. <laughs> um, she landed a role in Night School, the movie that came out in September. Yes. So we're going to talk about that and talk about really just acting. I'm an acting coach, so I love to talk to other actors. And I actually specialize in kids. So um, I, I, I have a good understanding of what you guys kind of go through. So how did you end up getting this role? You signed with an agent? Yes, Okay. AMG. Okay. Um, and how did you end up um, getting this role? Well, of course, the agency contacted my mom, and she was like, hey, you have this project. And uh, it was a self-tape, so we self uh, we did the tape, and then uh, it was first refusal. So uh, a couple a couple weeks later, we so got explain the call. to people who don't know what first refusal is. Explain that it's it's between two people, and uh, it's either one or the other. And of course, I got the role. I was <laughs> super happy, and my mom was filming me, and I was like, "Why are you filming me?" And she was like, "Isabella, guess what?" You got the project, and I started freaking out. I was so happy. Uh huh. So, what was? Um, how long did it take for you to be on set from that point? Um, I think we got the call like a couple months earlier. So, last year in November, uh, we started filming. Okay. So and the was, name of your character? Um, well, I'm Luis's daughter. Okay. Uh, so she doesn't really have a name. But. Okay. Um, so what was that? Was that your first time on? You've been in independent films, right? So yes. it wasn't your first time on set. Yeah. Okay. So what? Um, what? Well, yeah. What was it like? Um, everybody was awesome. They were really nice. Um, it was like my first time for like a major uh -huh. role. I was, I was like speechless. I still couldn't believe it. Were you nervous? Yes. <laughs> yeah, I would be. Um, who were some of the people that you met and who had influence on you? I met Kevin Hart and Tiffany Haddish. You got to meet Kevin Hart? Yes. Oh, my kids would die. They love Kevin Hart. Uh, he's like an amazing guy. I was so lucky to be working with everyone. So what was he, is he just as chipper and funny in person or? He's, yes. He's <laughs> um, very like, <laughs> How do I say this? It's like he's very open and he's like just very welcoming. He was. So he cuts up with everybody and yes. just makes everybody feel at home. Love actors like that. Who else did you say? Uh, Tiffany Haddish. Um, funny story. We were in one of the scenes and we were having breaks and I started like singing a song and we were all just singing songs. And then we started singing that song where um, just a small town girl. And then we did a duet. Oh, we'll sing some more of that. <laughs> <laughs> you can sing. Yeah, I do a lot of community theater, and that's where I get it from. Oh, so. love it. Okay, go back to the story. <laughs> just so, a small town girl. <laughs> we were singing that song, and um, we were just joking around, having fun, and I didn't know that she could sing, so uh, that was an amazing experience oh, wow, with her. Wow, that's awesome. Um, so how long did you film for? Um, I think we filmed for three days, like they were separated. Uh huh. Um, and then we also had to do some days of schoolwork, like extra schoolwork. We got to go to a hotel and everything. Wow. <laughs> because when you're on set, you still have to do your schoolwork and yes. you still have to. And I, I like to tell everybody, especially on a professional set, you're under SAG, um, you know, you're, you're under the union and so you're pretty protected they have did they have somebody that was with you pretty constant uh yeah I remember uh a man and a woman came to my trailer and he was just talking to my mom and then they were like so are you getting schoolwork are they feeding y'all and then uh, my mom said no we're not getting uh school and so they sorted everything out and we got school so they checked on you to make sure yeah that, that... was like the first day because yeah. like yeah, I was missing school, of course. So. Wow. Yeah, that's awesome. Um, so if you have, well, let's talk about training for a minute because you, you train? Yes, I'm uh, with uh, the Charlie group with okay. Miss Jackie. Okay. Uh, how do you think that's important to a young, it's important to an actor, period, but how do you think that that has helped you? 
Well, of course, there are like some skills that I haven't learned, of course, but Miss Jackie has been helping me along the way. And it just, if you have the training, it's way better like yeah. for your skills, of course. Well, you're not going to shut down. You're, you're going to get nervous because I, I believe that any actor that really cares about what they're doing, that, that nervous part is because you care about it or you wouldn't, yes. you wouldn't get nervous. <laughs> but if you haven't been put in different scenarios and you haven't been asked to make adjustments and you haven't um, learned to take direction, you're going to have a really hard time taking all that in at the same time. Yeah. What, did um, on set at all, did it get chaotic any? <laughs> of course, we were like being rushed around and stuff and like costume changes. I mean, not costume changes, just like wardrobe and uh -huh. makeup. But overall, I, it was an amazing experience. Yeah. I couldn't have asked for anything else. Every, every child that I've had on the show, I haven't had one that has said that it hasn't been an amazing experience. So <laughs> good for our productions. Um, I have for you some candy. And it's just to remind you that you're a gift in life. And as you grow, I, I like to tell um, all my, my kids this, you know, as you grow and you grow in this industry, if you stay with it, um, you will have eyes upon you. It'll, I don't know why. Every time when I say this to young kids, it makes me emotional. But, um, you know, so always make sure that, that you know, you stay open and, and be kind to people as much as you can. You can't be kind to everybody because there's some people that you just can't be kind to. But um, just know that, that other young girls are looking at you the way that you have people that you're looking at also. So if you have any, any advice to give to a young actress, what would it be? Um, I would definitely say that no matter how long you're filming or what you're filming, there's no guarantee that your shot will make it into a, the film because I actually had a scene with Kevin Hart and it didn't make it into the film. And of course I was sad, but I learned that no matter how much you're filming, there's no guarantee that your shot will make it to the film, so. And do you know why that is? Yes. Okay, why? Like, sometimes it doesn't like, <laughs> sometimes when they're writing the script, it sounds good, but sometimes it just doesn't go with the yes, film. Yes, <laughs> yes. So when the, when the writer is writing or the director is directing, um, you know, they're doing this different shot, shots and, and it could have nothing to do with you at all. It just didn't quite fit the storyline like they thought it was going to fit. Yeah. And so, yes, then you, you know, um, unfortunately you get cut from that. But the thing is, you still have that experience of and course. you still have that time with Kevin Hart and that will help you in the next thing that you're in. So. I've learned a lot from... Like, I've learned a lot from just experience, you know. Uh, I just love acting, you know. Yeah. Just, you meet so many people. Yeah. Well, and th that's really good that you gave that advice of, you know, don't get your feelings hurt if, you, if, <laughs> if it gets cut because that happens so much. Well, thank you, and I hope to follow you. If you get anything else, come back, and we'll talk about it and build a history for you. That's what I see this show doing. We're building a history um, for Atlanta and hopefully for – for other actors in other areas too. Um, but we hope this segment educated and inspired you.